What's up YouTube, Eggerkai here bringing you another custom action figure video. Today we're looking at the John Rambo figure from NECA, the First Blood Part 2 figure. And I really want to make him sweaty looking like he is in the movie 24-7. So right now he's been fully repainted from all of his skin I mean and his head's been repainted with a flat paint. And we're going to use this Mod Podge here which is a puzzle glue which is squeezes out of the tube white but dries clear and it's a very very cheap solution to making something look glossy it can be you can use it on eyes you can use it on blood or you could just make something completely sweaty which we're doing today so first i'm going to do the eyes I'm gonna just concentrate in that area um, so we know for sure that the eyes are going to be extra glossy as compared to the skin. So you can see right now it looks really light, but it's drying and drying and drying until it gets clear. And it also works as a protectant of your acrylic paint job, which is what I used for the base here. Now we're using a bigger brush and just going all over the body. Once again, you can see that it has a white film to it, but don't worry once it dries it's clear so we're quickly going all over the body super crudely um, super thinly as well it's not very I'm not putting it on there thick because I kind of want it to build up with the sculpt here so sort of dry brushing around certain areas you can see the difference between the stomach and the chest before I was able to put the gloss on it you can see that other arm is still matte, so it really makes a difference. It also makes the color pop a bit more and adds a bit of vibrancy to it. And now we're moving back onto the head. The eyes are already glossy, so now we can just lightly brush the Mod Podge on the face. And even if it touches the eyes, that's okay because we already know that they're already glossy. And we're just adding a bit to the hair, kind of dry brushing it on those raised parts of the sculpt so it can be a little shiny as well. And that's about it. Very super easy way to customize a figure and here he is every flesh part in the hair has a little shine to it which is conveying sweat and it's a super easy way to take an existing figure and if you want to make them look glisteny just buy this really cheap Mod Podge which is basically puzzle glue and there you go you can totally transform a figure here he is decked out with his rocket launcher and machine gun and grenade changing the lighting here to see what it looks like and I can't wait to take this guy outside bring him to a cool jungle setting and take some pictures of him and I will post those on my Instagram which is figures.jpeg it's a action figure photography Instagram that I've been running for a few years and I post some of these custom videos on there too so a quick roundabout here and I'm really happy with the way it came out so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more, and I will see you guys later.